Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Sorry it's been a while, um, I got a new job recently, but now I'm all settled in, I'll be filming more regularly. Um, so today I'm going to be filming a haul. Uh, it's mostly homeware. I do have a couple of other bits and bobs, so I'll show you those as well. But let's get started, shall we? Okay, so the first place I went to was Primark, and I've bought some homeware in Primark because they've got some really cute stuff in at the moment, and also, it's relatively cheap, like, I'm not made of money so I can't afford to buy 50 pound cushions, you know what I mean? And so I've just bought a couple of bits and bobs. The first thing I picked up was this um, pegboard here. It's hexagonal and it's got a copper frame on it. And then it's got loads of little coloured pegs. It's already got some things hanging on it, um, some pictures hanging on it. But I'll probably eventually replace those with my own pictures because I've got one of those Polaroid cameras that prints out the pictures as well. Um, but yeah, I really liked this. I, I'm obsessed with the colour copper at the moment. I'm also obsessed with bright colours at the moment. So this was just perfect. Um, so that'll be hanging up on my wall, hopefully. Next, I got some cushions. I got a plain turquoise cushion. Turquoise is my favourite colour. Um, and you can never go wrong with a plain cushion. It's kind of like a canvasy material. I probably won't use this to lean against or anything like that. This is purely just for decoration. I've already got cushions that I lean against, these here. Um, they're getting a bit old though. <laughs> Next cushion I got is this floral one. Again, it's got like blue and turquoise flowers on it, which I really liked. And it's also got purple and pink, and I'm really into purple. Purple and turquoise are probably my favourite colours. It says be unique on it. I just thought that was really cute because I think it's very important to like be yourself and not not follow everyone else and be be what other people are. Next I bought some lights. Um, the first light I picked up was this one. It's an S. Of course my name's Savannah so that went perfectly for me. Uh, this one you can stand it up and I think you can hang it up as well but it lights up which is really cool. They had some other letters as well. So if your name doesn't begin with an S, I think they had an A and they had a Z. So they've probably got like all the letters, it just depends on where you are. Um, but this is the first time I've seen an S so that's why I picked that up. I picked up some LED lights and these are to replace some of the ones in the background here because they're, as you can see, they're a bit yellow. And these are on a copper wire and they've got little hearts on them. They're battery operated as well. I picked up a nail varnish in Primark as well. It's blue and metallic. Um, I haven't tried it out yet, I'm not sure how good it's going to be. But it's called Martian. Um, I just really liked the idea of metallic blue because you don't come across that very often. Um, so that's why I picked that one up. And the last thing I picked up in Primark was a pair of shoes. Um, I've got a pair of shoes like this that I wear to work. but. Um, because I work in a kitchen, it gets quite, they get quite dirty and I really like the way these look so I decided to pick up a pair to wear at home as well or just when I'm out and about and these were £6 So I thought that was quite good because if you buy vans from the van shop they are quite expensive um, and I go through shoes like no one's business so. <laughs> I thought I'd pick up a pair of these. The next place that I went to was Lush. My cousin, she told me that she'd got a lip scrub and she was showing me it and she was telling me how brilliant it was. And we both want the Jeffree Star lip scrubs, but obviously they're always out of stock so we can't get them. Yeah, she, she told me about the Lush lip scrub and she was telling me how good it was. So I thought I'd go and pick one up. The one that she's got is the bubblegum one, but I didn't really like the smell of that one. So I picked up mint juleps, or mint, mint juleps, I don't know, but it smells like mint chocolate, which is my favourite flavour of ice cream, so I thought why not get that for my lips. I tried it on in the shop and oh my god, it makes your lips feel so tingly and fresh and lovely. So yeah, I picked that one up. Next I visited a shop called Tiger. I love Tiger, it's basically like Ikea, but for homeware and decorations, it's not got furniture in it. Um, but again, I think it's Swedish, I think, 
but it's just full of loads of really cool bits and bobs like stationery and kitchenware and candles and decorations just all sorts really you can go in there and you can pretty much find anything that's like little and they're all really funky and cool like they've got things that are like shaped like fruit and like weird things like that it's quite quirky and i love it um but i picked up these led lights they are little metal um wire balls they look a bit like lanterns and they're all different colors um but the lights inside them are just white i think or blue um, but yeah, I'll be putting those up in the background as well. I really can't wait to get those up because I love all the colours. And they've even got one that's like coppery kind of coloured as well, which I'm really pleased about because I wanted to get the copper copper wire um, lights from Primark, but they didn't have any in my Primark, so I'm really sad about that because I really liked those. Um, but these are just as good. These were... These were five pounds. Again, these are battery operated. I only buy the battery operate operated ones because... <laughs> <laughs> because I don't have any plugs on this side of the room or my plugs are on that side. Um, it's too much of a hassle to have to plug them in. Plus they get hotter if you have plug ones, which is why I buy the battery ones. I don't want anything to catch on fire. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, and the last thing I bought was from the card factory. It's just a, a candle in a jar. Um, it's by the company Mocktails, and it's number four blueberry and lime. This was two ninety nine. Can you believe that? And it smells really, really nice. I picked this one because it was the only one that I liked the smell of. But I thought it was really cute with the, with the fact that it's in a jar. And also, I liked the little string around it and the little label, and I liked the fact that it was all printed on the front of the jar, what it was as well. I thought that was really cute, and I can use the jar afterwards to put my makeup brushes in or something like that. So that's everything that I bought to redecorate my room with. Let me know in the comments below uh, what your favourite thing is, or if you're redecorating your room, what's your favourite item in your room now. Please don't forget to like my video um, if you enjoyed it. And also don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. If this video gets to 100 likes, I will do a tutorial on my hairstyle here. I get a lot of questions when I wear a hairstyle like this, like... How did you do it? And so, yeah, if this video gets to 100 likes, I will show you how I got this hairstyle. Stay tuned, I am doing a collaboration soon with my cousin who's also got a YouTube channel. I'll link her channel down below so you can check her out as well if you haven't already. We are going to be doing... I'm also going to be filming a get ready with me because I'm going out on Friday night with my with my boyfriend, my best friend and my cousin and some other friends as well. I'm going to be filming my makeup, my hair and I might possibly film my outfit as well. So let me know down below if that's something you'd like to see because I'm going to be filming it anyway and if you want to see the outfit as well then I will add that into the video. Um, but that will be up on Friday for definite. Uh, thank you guys so, so much for watching and I will see you next time.